right now, me and the girls, <laughs> me and the girls are at Target. We're popping in really quick to see if I can find any more Studio McGee finds, um, stuff that I haven't seen already. But the girls want to say hi. Say hi, Ray. Hi. Hi. Hi, Helen. Riley lost her two front teeth. Well, didn't lose them. The dentist pulled them out yesterday, so she's still getting used to that. But um, I'm just gonna take a look around to see if they have anything good. Really like this basket. Searching for something that ain't lost. Have we got our life? Some of these receipts in there. <laughs> this one is really There's a whole bunch of these vases here. These are really nice too. Very heavy. Wait. I've been seeing this wreath everywhere. I feel like everyone is picking this one up, so I don't know if I want this one or not just yet. Just because everyone I feel like is grabbing this one. But look how pretty it is. It's so neutral. Oh my gosh, you guys, I really love this pillow. I just don't know if it's gonna blend into our couch too much because our couch is kind of that color. But look how pretty. And it's so soft. So soft. And it's so it's huge. Look at my hand. That's a big pillow. really pretty. Love that pillow. I also really like this one. These are cute. I like the pot that it's in. In the Dollar Tree right now and look you guys they already have fall florals it says happy fall I think most of them are $1.25 but aren't they pretty ah, who's ready for fall oh my god it's coming around the corner so fast I see some fall stuff look at all the fall florals oh my god so excited. These are really pretty. So I'm kind of looking for these, but in that neutral beige color that everyone has. So I'm gonna see if I can find those. So pretty. So I'm looking for these stems, but in the beige color. I haven't found them yet. I see all these other ones, but not yet. Let's see. Hey you guys, I think I found them. They're just like stuffed in there. They look like this. These sell out so fast every year, so I might as well just get them now. I don't know. There's a 20% off coupon for $9.99. Is it worth it? I don't know yet. The clock is too cute. How much is it? $8.99. It's small. That's cute. I have a quick grocery haul that I wanted to share with you guys. Most of the items that I picked up are going to be for tonight's dinner. So let's go ahead and get started. So over here I have some Tostitos original restaurant style chips. And then I picked up some Monterey Jack block cheese. Some wipes for Holland. And then I came across this Dr. Till's Pure Epsom Salt. Uh, it's a melatonin sleep soak with essential oil blends. I thought that would be perfect for me to use tonight because I have a really bad sciatic nerve and I just need to relax. So hopefully this does the job. I don't know, but we shall see. And then to pair with that, I also picked up the Dr. Till's foaming bath with pure Epsom salt. So, you know, pretty much anything lavender helps to relax you. So I'm thinking this might be a good one. I'll let you guys know. I also picked up some Kraft Macaroni and Cheese Singles for the kids and some Mandarin Oranges. 
They love these mandarin oranges. They're always fighting over them. And then I have some jalapenos, some cheese dip, and the white queso dip that's going to be used for the nachos tonight. So I'm gonna be making chicken nachos and then probably lobster nachos. I'm not too sure about the lobster nachos just yet because I am a little bit tired, but we'll see. And then I have some ranch, some beans over there, canned beans, some, a white onion, a white, what? <laughs> A red onion, a white onion, avocados, Roma tomatoes, jalapeno, cilantro. I just put it in this bowl that way I can clean them after I'm done filming this. And then some limes and bananas. And yeah, that's it. I don't know if I mentioned, but also some ranch. I'm telling you that there ain't no other way. Pack your bags and then you will go away. I'm not gonna be begging you to stay. And maybe if you asked me yesterday, I would handle this shit differently. Things are different, I'm a new me. That's not gonna happen. That's not gonna happen. That's not, that's not gonna happen. So even if you're asking, even, even if you're asking, cause I do. Okay, so I just got done seasoning my chicken. And when I tell you, this smells so good. It smells bomb. I know it's raw chicken, so it might look disgusting to you, but whew, when I tell you the aroma in here, between the guacamole, the pico de gallo, all the smells are just coming into one. It smells so good. It's making me even more hungry. But really quick, I wanted to tell you guys what I seasoned it with. I seasoned with seasoned salt, garlic powder, black pepper. I added in a little bit of um, chili powder just to add some color to this chicken. And you guys, this meal is inspired by my sister, Shanti. She makes the best nachos in the world. I'm telling you, her nachos are bomb. Like I said, it is inspired. <laughs> There's no way I think that I can even compare my nachos to her. I'm just really craving her nachos, so I thought I would just go ahead and take it upon myself to try and make them. Now, she does live a bit further from me, so I can't just go to her house and be like, Shanti, I want some nachos so here we are so i'm about to fry this chicken up and then continue on with the dinner what i do and it's time for something new yeah so here is what dinner came out looking like this was my plate and then i forgot to add sour cream so i'm inserting that fo footage right now and then the next plate is going to be my daughter's plate. She didn't want all of that on there, so I just made it nice and simple for her. Guys, so it's the next day. Excuse the way I look. I literally have on no makeup. I just have a mascara and then chapstick. But y'all, if you guys have any recommendations, I feel like I look like a raccoon right now. I need some sleep, but mom life, okay? So yesterday I went to Michael's, you guys saw that. There was a bunch of fall florals. I didn't pick up anything. I decided to just wait because I know a floral does come out with a lot of beautiful, beautiful fall florals. And I'll just save my coins and wait until those release. So yeah, so today I'm going to be going to Walmart. I'm hoping to pick up some gold spray paint because there is a picture light that I picked up from Amazon and it came in like this cheap gold color, which I'm not a fan of. So I'm gonna go ahead and DIY that at home. Hopefully it goes well. I'll take you guys along the process. I'm gonna show you guys the picture light before um, I get started. That way you can see the before and after, but it's really pretty and it was really affordable. I'll link it down below in case any of you are interested. But right now I'm just sitting here on the couch hanging out with the girls i'm um, making lunch we're going to be having a chicken salad it's kind of been a slow morning so the day is just now getting started the girls are staring at me over there yeah let me go ahead and show you guys the picture light
so it is much later in the day I had to get my workout in really quick but here is what the picture light looks like here's from another angle I told you guys that I would share it and here it is I have it above these two frames that I got from Target from the Studio McGee collection now, as you can see it's a very bright gold which I'm not a fan of so I'm gonna see if I can achieve a bit of a darker gold I don't know how it's gonna come out but I grabbed a little small can of spray paint from Hobby Lobby so we'll just see how it goes I'm gonna take the light down now and then go ahead and spray paint it and I'll show you guys the after hey guys so today is a pretty exciting day one of the rugs that I had ordered finally came in the mail it's from Ruggable so I'm really excited I'm gonna flip you guys around in just a minute and show you guys where I'm putting it but first let me say I know I look a hot mess okay I'm so so tired today my eyes are puffy it's just it's been a week we've been taking the kids out letting them go swimming enjoying their summer as we all know summer is going to be coming to an end pretty soon the kids are going to be going back to school and all that good stuff but today we are focusing on the apartment so i'm going to be doing some cleaning laying this new rug down you guys when i say i cannot wait to get rid of the rug that i have now i cannot wait i don't even know what i was thinking let me go ahead and flip you guys around just so that you know what I'm talking about. One second. Okay, guys. So here's what the living room looks like. So this is the rug that I was talking about. I don't know what I was thinking when I got this rug. I got it from Target. It's an indoor outdoor rug. But you guys, it's like a super, super headache to try to get clean. Look at all these stains. I can't get that out. It's a faux jute rug. And look, it's already like pulling apart. The kids have spilled so many things on here and it's just time for it to go i cannot stand it. it just it looks dirty i honestly was never like a real fan of rugs only because i hate when i can't clean stuff and it just ooh, it makes me cringe so this needs to go that's what it looks like and then you guys the couch is a mess everything just looks so blah in here right now fyi i also really hate this couch <laughs> but i'm grateful for it at least we have one right so there's also a tray that I want to place on this coffee table today and style it. So yeah, this is the new rug from Ruggable. I'm really excited to see how it's going to look. So let's just go ahead and jump right into it. We are who we are. Why don't I be me and you be you? We're spreading I just have to show you guys really quick how disgusting this is like look first of all this um what is it called the rug pad didn't even fit all the way um for the rug and just look at all these gummy bears and all this stuff like how does this happen ew <laughs> look how bad this rug looks oh i can't wait to pull this up all right Keep on doing what you do, doing what you do. Just keep on doing what you do, doing what you do, doing what you do, doing what you do, doing what you like to, what you like to do, do what you like, do what you like to, what you like to do. to express yourself in your own way and we could have some fun no problems coming in Just keep on doing what you do, 
So now that the floor has dried and I've cleaned the baseboards, it is finally time to start laying the rug down. rug is officially down <laughs> i'm sweating right now it was hard for me only because i was trying to figure out the placement of it but isn't it so pretty holland likes the rug you feel the rug right yeah it's soft really soft soft holland's having a ball they've been running around on it since i laid it down but now it's time to move all the furniture back probably gonna be a struggle but Gotta get it in. Before I put anything back onto the couch, I wanted to make sure that it was cleaned really good. So here you see me using my Bissell Little Green Spot Cleaner. You guys, I love this product so much. I'll link it down below in case any of you would like to try it out. But yeah, let's do this and then continue on. I pull into your driveway, it's a Saturday night. You look like a million bucks wearing that dress I like. You're smiling, but there's something missing in your eyes. Girl, I can tell that you have something on your mind. But I will make you forget all your sorrows. Let go like there's no tomorrow. Let's have a drink, just relax. All your problems will fade. If you're ready for a good time, count on me. There's a party your problems away i'm all about the good vibes i know you're all about the good vibes do you know how much i love you want to see you smile where's that happy girl that i know with a heart on fire i'll do anything to make it fine but i can tell that you have something on your mind right now but i will make you forget all this honestly looks so much better so now i'm just going to rewipe the coffee table with my method daily wood cleaner and then i'm going to style that tray that you see over there on my left and yeah you guys when i tell you that i'm obsessed with this tray i love it so much one of the greatest home goods finds 
actually i was really on the hunt for this tray for a very long time so i'm really just happy that i finally found it i'm going out way tonight are you close to here mm -hmm. i'm feeling down i don't know why i know it's so surreal think i want you here so here's what the living room looks like right now i've already styled the coffee table and then i just threw on this blanket that i usually keep on this side of the couch this is from the studio mcgee collection at target i've had that for a while now if it's loud in the background excuse it because they're working on the yard outside of the complex um but i have these pillows here that i want to incorporate in on the couch so we'll see how those look but look how pretty this pillow is doesn't that look so nice compared to the rug so we're gonna add some pillows on there and then see how that looks also i really need to clean this area give it a nice little dust so yeah once i'm done with that i'll give you guys like a feel of how the room looks with the new rug and the pillows on the couch so this is one of my favorite pillows right now i love this pillow so much but i'd like to keep it over here in this corner only because the directions say to spot clean only and y'all i don't want this being messed up whatsoever i keep it over here because my kids and my fiance tend to mo mostly be over there on the other side of the couch so i know it'll be safe here and they won't be um, laying on it and all that stuff so i'm trying to protect this pillow as much as possible so i like this one over here that one's gonna stay and then this pillow i'm not sure where i want to put this one yet but you guys don't get me wrong i love um, i don't just buy pillows just for them to sit pretty on the couch i want us to be able to use them and be comfortable on them so i preferably i preferably like to buy the ones that have the remove the can't talk today i preferably like to buy the ones that have the removable covers so i know that i'm able to wash them the ones that say spot clean only i typically just try to stay away from because they can only be spot cleaned and most of the time they'll need a good wash so I try to get the ones that have a zipper closure and I know I can wash them. So this one, I don't know, like I said, where I want to put it yet, but I know I want it to go here in the living room. I'm just going to kind of play around with the pillows and see what I get. You were like me, you want to be free like a summer night. Mm -hmm. I'm feeling down, I don't know why, what an alibi. But I'm glad you're here. So I really don't know where I want to put this pillow just yet. I like it next to this one here, but I feel like because it's so large, this one looks funny next to it. You guys will have to let me know what you think. I'm still trying to play around. I had two other white pillows on this couch, but I took them down because they did not wash well. So I'm still trying to figure out my pillows, but let me know um, where you guys think I should put this one here. I may leave it over there in that corner just for now. I don't know. I'm just gonna leave it here and then just wait and see. I don't know. I'm just gonna leave it there for now and just look at it <laughs> and then figure it out later. I don't know. You guys will probably see it in a different spot um, before this video is up, but let me just go ahead and continue on.
about to leave Already packing Come with me I'm not really asking We'll get away To a place where we don't know About to see The world in action What we can be Life with no distractions We'll get away This is what we waited for Take my hand, we'll make it somehow We can't miss out I'm done living life with the lights out Die with my own doubts Be free with me Be free Be free with me Be free Not looking back Eyes on the freeway, Bonnie and Clyde, a classic cliche, we're on the run, this is what we waited for. Take my hand, we'll make it somehow, we can't miss out. I'm done living life with the lights out. We're just gonna wait on the pillows. Hopefully, maybe I'll come across some more. And then also the um, coffee table books. I feel like I haven't shown you guys this area in so long. So a lot has changed, as you can see. My decor style is very different, but I wanted to share this decor piece right here really quick because it is probably one of my favorites right now. This is from Home Goods. Look how pretty it is. When I saw it, I was like, I need this. I snatched it up. Um, I have been seeing a lot of these in model homes, so I definitely wanted it for our space. And then I don't know if I've shown you guys our olive tree. We have that there as well. And then this candle here is from the Hearth and Hand collection. This is in the scent, I think it's lemon pie. It doesn't smell like lemon pie though. It smells really good. So yeah, we have that, and then some books, and then this lamp here from Pottery Barn. So yeah, and there's Holland. Holland. Hi, can you say hi to the vlog? Hi. Hi, she just woke up from a nap. But yeah, you guys, I hope you liked the way the living room came out. I'm gonna close out today's vlog now. So I will see you guys all in the next one. Say bye. 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 Here's to the good days. Here's to the sorrows. If this is a mistake, I know about tomorrow. I don't want to fight no more because I don't feel the need no more. No, just want to make it stop.